today's lab has cell comparison. Okay, and in today's lab, we will be talking about prokaryotic and eukaryotic cells. Prokaryotic cells are bacteria only, and they do not have nucleus. And then eukaryotic do have nucleuses. Okay. Okay, and so for today's lab, we will be covering some oxidation. And like what we'll be using the like how we'll observe is use wet mounts, and I'll teach you how to do that in a minute. Okay, so the first thing we'll be observing today is yogurt. And um, how we make yogurt is we add um, acidophilus bacteria to um, milk, and then it becomes yogurt, and they're prokaryotic cells. So those are the only prokaryotic cells we will be talking about today in yogurt. Okay, and then the next thing we'll observe is, a, is plant leaf cells, and you'll notice chloro, chloroplasts in them. And then we'll be observing onion cells, and with these we'll be dyeing them with methylene blue, so you can see the nucleus, and then we'll just dye the nucleus blue. And then we'll be going, and we'll do potato cells, and we'll use iodine to turn them black, like you remember, if you remember in the macro molecules lab, we turn um, them black. And then we'll be doing human cheek cells, and we'll use methylene blue again to dye the nucleus. First, get a slide and then make sure it's clean. And so the first one we're doing is the yogurt. And so just with the yogurt, just get some of it onto the slide. It doesn't need to be a huge amount. And then after that, get some water on it. Just um, like about that much water, just enough to cover it. And then we will be using these um, glass parts and you'll put them on. Now with them, put the glass at the edge and then drop it over and it will make all the bubbles go out when you drop it over like that. And be sure to like put it on the side and then drop it over so you don't have bubbles messing with your observations. Okay, and after yogurt, we will do plant leaf cells and we will put these also in slides of water. And then we'll be doing the onion again with and your teacher will help you cut the onion so you can test it and then you'll be putting the um, methylene blue on it and then we'll do potatoes your teacher again will help you cut these into testing and then you'll put iodine on it and then the last the human cheek so <laughs> you will get a clean slide and you will put one drop of water first because we are doing the human cheek cells so just uh, a little bit of water on it. Set it down. Okay, then we, now to get your cheek cells, you'll take a toothpick and you'll count like, you'll swab it up and down like 10 times and I'll get these enough cheek cells to do it. So you just go like this. And then after you've got that, you rub it, um, you just rub your toothpick around in the water to get off the cells. And then after you get off the cells, you'll take the, blue, the um, methylene blue, which dyes it, the nucleus is blue, and you'll just put one drop into it, and it will dye the nucleus is blue. And then you'll put the glass cover over it, and so you just put it at the edge, and then drop it, and it will take out the air bubbles. Okay, and then after you're done doing the lab, don't forget to fill out your laboratory report and turn it into the teacher.